so, so the entrepreneurial impulse is is to do it yourself because that's how it gets done right. And that that's great. I think early on in a business, you know, you wear a lot of hats and you you learn how to do everything so that you can train the salesperson when you bring them in. Right. One of the classic mistakes, for example, is I know how to sell this thing. Well, let's bring in a sales team and I'll train them. Right. And what you don't realize is that early on, people are only buying from you because you're incredibly passionate about the thing you're talking about. And you can't transfer that to a professional salesperson so early. Right. So people tend to, to stack up and, and hire others a little bit too early before they've really done the thing and learned it. I think as founders, you, you have to be able to do any role in your business. Right. The first thing we did in, in that ambulance dispatch company, Penpoint Technologies, whenever we hired somebody, go get an ambulance. You're riding around an ambulance this week. That's it. Right. You're going to experience this world. You're going to get empathy for it. You're going to understand the people that drive these vehicles, you know, how they put themselves in risky situations. So I think they, they think about making sure people really understand the customers. Right. And, and when they're not good at something, you just say, I'm not good at it. Let's hire that. That's OK. But, you know, you can't just immediately outsource something and a company is trying to find product market fit. Right. First, you've got to experience it as a founder to be able to transfer that insight and knowledge to the people you do hire. And don't you think 